Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we will take a look at how to fix Aurora launcher that keeps stopping problem. Now don't forget to hit that like and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you're updated whenever we upload a new video. Stick until the very end so you don't miss a single detail. Now the first thing that we will do is go ahead and make sure that your Aurora launcher is up to its current version or it is up to date. Now what we would need to do is to go into a Play Store right here and then just go ahead and search for Aurora Launcher right here. And then you should be able to see the Aurora app itself right here. And if it says update on the right side instead of the word open, then that means that you need to go ahead and update the app itself. Now don't forget to go ahead and restart your phone so that this will clear everything up. But another thing that we can go ahead and do is let's go ahead and clear our cache in our app itself. So let's go into our settings right here and we're gonna go all the way down until we can go ahead and see the apps section. So go ahead and click on this. Now we need to search for Aurora itself. So just go ahead and click on the search icon on the top right and then search for Aurora launcher right here. Now, once that you are in this section, then you should be able to see the storage right here. If the app is still running, just go ahead and click for stop on the bottom right. And then we're going to go into storage right here. And what we're going to be doing is we're going to be clearing the data on the bottom left. So go ahead and click on this and then click delete. This will then clear up all of your data in the Aurora launcher and cache as well, this, which will put it into its most recent form. And then what you need to do now is to go ahead and restart your phone. So don't forget this part, go ahead and restart your phone. And then once that has been restarted, then just go ahead and click on Aurora right here. And there you go. So this will prepare everything up at, as if it is a newly created app. And there you go. Now you should be able to go ahead and use the Aurora launcher. I hope that you have found this tutorial useful. See you guys next time.